friend of mine asked me to watch a video. Um, it's not in English, but it really doesn't matter. Um, let me ask you a question. Does this person believe they live on a, a spinning ball? In a vacuum? Because if that's the case, then I don't know. I personally would not be so much. I wouldn't be listening or taking advice from someone who's retarded. Because if if this person or these people believe that. I mean, there, what, what's the sense in even continuing on? Um, sorry, got metal shavings in my shoe. Uh, and the other thing is, um, my opinion shouldn't matter should be your opinion that matters. I can't decide. I can't tell you or nor would I ever want to tell anyone what to think or what to believe. You have to know. Do you know? At one time, there was only TV and radio. Well, there was radio and TV. And that's where all the programming came through. And well, that's all it was, so everyone took that as, well, that must be reality. Now, there's the internet. internet changed all that and of course they know that was gonna happen and they knew let's just say You can look like, or you can talk like, or you can say things that could make you agree with people. But the thing you have to look out for is the contradiction. And it has to always go back to what you know. Because if you're using something else as your compass, then it's it's not you. You're you're uh, either being scared or or talked out of or diverted from yourself. And you put your blood up, I put my blood up to bring forth heaven on earth for the benefit of all. And I did it because I saw what was going on. I I'm trying to put this the right way. Um,
If you look around and go through your own personal experiences and you see just the lying, the backstabbing, the selfishness, the oh man, there's a lot worse things. But I don't even like to say it because, I mean, I don't like that shit in my fucking head. You know what I'm talking about. If well, you put your blood up, you should know that. Um, In your heart, do you feel like you're satanic? Do you feel like, I mean, no. There are, every, every, every movement through this, there are new things started and and what they do is they take different lies and they just combine them, rearrange them, and you know, because as soon as people, as soon as they know the knowledge that you have or a particular person has, it's not hard to to go okay, repeat exactly what. Uh, what these people know, then you have them, and then you can you know, continue to manipulate them. Because what's going on right now is they're setting up two factions. All right, and well, I'm sure you can figure out what's going to happen. After this, there's going to be a trigger, the Jabbo, I'm not saying this is going to happen, but it could very well happen, Be it could be part of what they're going to do, you could actually see people die, a lot of people die, and then you already have these people running around nuts in stores and stuff you know chasing after people and for not wearing masks and then you have the other side which is heavily religious or religified to be the enemy of these other people there's only one way out You've already done it. I've already done it. We're waiting on 144,000 to finish doing it. Is to put your blood up. To bring forth heaven on earth. See, there's a lot of people on the internet, and they're spiritual leaders or whatever. The fact that they're, the word leader is in there should give you some indication. The fact that they sit up on stages in a chair above everyone while a giant audience is following them are is in itself a contradiction of what they say. They don't talk about the fact that you do not live on a spinning ball. That is the lie. If you're going to tell the truth, 
and claim you know, then that would be the thing you would go with. That would be, that's it, because everything else falls after that. Everything else becomes suspect. Maybe not right away, but eventually you figure it out. So, at this point, if a person's not, if a person believes they live on a spinning ball, they're, they're not worth your time. I'm, and I don't mean not worth your time to, as an, another person, you wouldn't help them or, or be the person that you are towards them, but that you would contemplate whatever they say when they have no idea what they're talking about. Or they do know what they're talking about, and like I said, there's plenty of people out there distracting and diverting. Listen, that's what their goal is to get 144,000 and not to do blood over intent. It's really that simple. Um, and I know maybe I don't know what you watch or what you don't watch and stuff like that, but I watch everything kind of like, uh, hmm, I don't know, like, like a puzzle. I try to figure the puzzle out. Even the most obscure, innocent thing, especially if you've done blood over in time, could very well be directed to you to make it look like something or something else. That's why we put our blood up, so we know who's who, what's what. Because all these uh, gurus and stuff who claim to have their third eye open and they know, no, they couldn't. Their blood would be up if their third eye was, or could even be opening. It's through selfless acts. It's through being selfless, not for any other reason, but that that's how you want to be treated. And there are going to be people around you, and they might come close to being on the same page as you, but if you dig deeper, you'll see that they're not. Um, here's the thing. It's like, I'll give you an example. I have this uh, argument, and... It usually happens with people who are halfway awake or halfway intelligent and have a little bit of knowledge. You can talk to these people and you can go, well, they'll see everything that's fucked up, right? But you'll be like, well, all we have to do is this and it can be fixed and you can live in a perfect world. But there's people out there who will tell you, no, that's not possible. That can't happen. Well, of course not. It can't happen for them. And they're never going to make it happen. 
because they are already under the belief that that it can't. <laughs> you see? It can. It will. It is. That's all there is to it. Now, I'm not saying we ain't going to see some shit. Because we're going to see some fucking shit. And... Listen, our YouTube channels don't get fucked with the way they get fucked with if we didn't know what the fuck we were doing or talking about. Because if you think about it, people, when, when you go and you talk to an individual person about the not living on a spinning ball and uh, blood over intent and, and religion and everything else, they fucking freak out. Now, look at all of us who have made videos and stuff for blood over intent. These people should be having a field day. We should have good billions of subscribers just making fun of us. It doesn't happen. It might happen now. Very funny how when we say shit. <laughs> Look, here's the thing. I, I'm not going to do it on video because it really doesn't fucking matter. But I'm telling you, I can show you all my videos and I can show you some other people's videos who have a a lot of subscribers and and the same with other people who have done blood over intent and other let's just say different genres or or aspects of uh, the lie and you'll see uh, we'll say something and then a little while later suddenly, magically all these people talk about the same thing they're just co-opting. That's it. Is it the right thing to do blood over intent? Well, you did it. I did it. It's in your heart. You know it. But they're going to take a lot of the programming that we've all had through our time of being here, since we were birthed in here. And they're going to use it to distract you or to try to get you to not do blood over intent or whatever. You just have to be strong in your own wisdom and know that you're doing the right thing because you are. You have to use both sides. You have 